Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. In this video, we will learn about the another operator that is ease empty operator. This comes under this conditional and boolean operators. So let's try to learn about this ease empty. Ease empty operator, as the name itself suggests that show, shows that ease empty means it will tell you that whether the source observable is empty or not. That means if a source observable it emits at least one value, then it will return false. Or otherwise, if the source observable doesn't return any value and it completes, then it will return true. So that means that source observable is empty. Now here, if you try to see that emits false if the input observable emits any value, at least one value. If it emits any value, any value, it emits false. Or emits true if the input observable completes and without emit any value. So it will emit, it will return you the true if the input observable completes without emitting any values. So this is the is empty. It's a straight, pretty straightforward. Is empty doesn't have any parameters or anything, so just it's a simple is empty. And here it will return always the boolean. And here you can see that the function that returns observable that emits boolean value indicating whether the source observable is empty or not. If you want to know that whether the source observable is empty or not, means you can use this is empty operator. And here you can able to see that a source observable is there which doesn't emit any value and it completes. Then if you apply this pipe operator uh, is empty, then it will return the true. So this is about the is empty operator. Now here you will be able to see that is empty transforms an observable that emits value in, into an observable that emits a single boolean value. That means what I can say is a uh, is empty operator transforms an observable which is emitting the values. It transforms into a observable that emits only single boolean value. That is the thing he is trying to say. As soon as the source observer emits a value, is empty will emit a false and it completes. Immediately it will complete. If the source observer completes, have not emitting, emitted anything yet, is empty will emit a true and complete. Okay, so this is the about this is empty. So similar effect we can achieve it through the count, but is empty can can emit a false very sooner. So I will show you that when it will re, how it will emit very fast. I will show you that what is the difference between this count and is empty. We can achieve this using the count operator also. If the count operator is returning zero means that is nothing but the source observer does not emit any value. If the count operator emits greater than zero means that means at least one value is emitted by the source observable. So whereas is empty operator, the main difference between those two means is empty operator immediately if one if any value is emitted means it will immediately return you the false so that the it the so uh, the value we can get it very faster. Whereas the count what it will try to do is it will wait until the source observable is completed. So if the source observable is completed only then only it will give you the total count. So by that count we can decide that we can decide that if it is greater than zero means it is empty or not. So that is the difference between the is empty and the count. So just because of the performance scenario, we will be using this is empty. Let's try to see the practical implementation of this is empty. So it's pretty straightforward. What I can do is I am creating is empty operator here, and let's go to the operator dot component dot html, and here I will add is empty is empty, and here also I can use is empty. That is it and let us go to the app routing and here in this app routing what I will try to do is here let us try to add sorry yeah here is empty and here let us try to add is empty so whether it will come or not is empty e is empty so I think now it will come I think no it is not coming is empty operator right is empty sorry is empty operator component let us try to add it and let us try to add it at the top let us close this one all and here if I go so here we will write it and here I can add something like is empty and it could be taken from I can minim minimize this one also yeah it can be taken from is empty operator slash is empty operator that is it. Now let us go to the is empty operator implementation. Now let us assume that we have a source observable same thing so I will show you so I have a source of off of 1 comma 2 comma 3. And if I try to use this source observable dot subscribe 
of data okay now i will do console.log of data just we'll do console.log of data and here if i try to do pipe of is empty now i want to apply pipe of is empty so i will use is empty that's it so if i use this is empty so it will tell you so now it will return you the source of here it will return you that false why because the source observable is emptying the values 1 2 3 now if i go here and if i try to see the output and here is empty so it is returning false as usual what we have understood now what i will try to do is in the same scenario we will try to achieve it through the count so i will copy this one and paste it here and i will use the count operator so if i sorry if i use this count operator let's try to do, let's import this count operator yeah let's try to see the output here now if i refresh this page now what could be the output here so 3 is the output now what i can do here if data okay if it is returning true means then you can write something like console.log empty okay empty observable by is empty something like this and here else i can write something like and i can copy here and i can paste it here not empty observable okay i can copy the same thing and i can remove this console.log and i can use the same thing here also so here this one is coming by the count and here this is coming by the count that's it now if you try to see the output what will happen now it is now it is telling that not empty observable by is empty not empty so it is telling that okay so if it is true means so is empty is true means okay fine if data okay if data if nothing is there means okay okay not empty i need to keep here empty i need to keep here so the difference is like this now let's try to see the output here now both of the things are dis displaying the output not empty observable by is empty so both of the operators has given the same output now let's try to see that when this one will fail so how this is empty will be performance will give performance now i let's try to write that i have a new observable okay so this observable has an observer now what i will try to do here here i will try to use something like observer dot next of one it will send you the next value so now what i will try to do here i will write set timeout after some time so that means after some something like uh, 4000 4000 milliseconds means 4 seconds i will try to send another value observer dot next of 2 and then afterwards only i will try to complete it observer dot complete so then only this observable will be completed now if you try to see the output now the you will be able to understand the output here if i try to refresh this page yeah if i refresh this page see is empty observable has told that that observable is not empty but after some time the count is telling so that means the count what is what is this count is doing is the count will wait until the observable is completed when this observable is completed only then it will take the total number of values and it will give you into the subscribe thing so based on the count if it is greater than zero means then we can decide that it is an empty observable or not an empty observable whereas this is empty what it will try to do is is empty as soon as it, it emits single value immediately it understood that it is not empty so then immediately it will execute the subscribe and it will it will complete the observable immediately so this is how the is empty and the count uh, performs so if you want to know own if you don't bother about the values and about the count you want to know whether the so observable whatever the observable is emitting emitting is empty or not if you want to check means you can use this is empty or otherwise you can use count or anything okay hope you understood is about this is empty and the performance thing also if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you